Hey everyone, Johnny here. I wanted to drop a quick video to tell you about a new feature that just got dropped into Blender development. In a previous video when I talked about creating a brick wall using geometry nodes, we had to do some hacks to get the bricks to follow the contour of the wall. Well now, a new attribute has been added, which is the vertex normal attribute. This attribute will expose the vertex normal of each vertex to your geometry node tree. So here I have a cylinder where I've rotated every other row. And here I've got a grid where I've shifted every other row. To each one, I added a point instance node, this one pointing to this cube, and this one pointing to this little rectangle. And then an align rotation to vector node using the vertex normal. And as you can see, this cylinder worked just perfectly. This is going to add a lot of flexibility into geometry nodes to be able to access this information in our node trees. Another item to note, since my previous videos on geometry nodes, is the addition of a lookup box for any attributes. So for instance, when I click this vector attribute, it lists all of the attributes that are currently available to my model. My UV map, the point positions, the vertex normals of all of the points, and the material index. And if I were to add some extra attributes via another node, those would show up here as well. I'm sure there's a lot more to figure out, but I just wanted to get this out there so you could check it out. This build will probably be available on the builder.blender.org website as of 3-7-2021. I'd highly recommend downloading it and checking out this new feature. Thanks for stopping by my video. Talk to you later.